started today with an Easter-themed fashion show for our children. In this week's Style File by Diamonds of Midland, we're looking at some of the hot trends for spring clothes. So we're here inside Music City Mall at their fabulous Easter scene where you can have your picture taken with the Easter Bunny, but today we're talking Easter fashions. Easter fashions for our kiddos. Love this. We're going to start with our very youngest babies. You know, we've had a baby boom at Studio we have, 7. We have. And so we want to welcome Harper. Yes, Harper mm -hmm. is here. Um, with her cousin Blake oh. and Harper is wearing a little outfit by Oat Baby from Kensington Closet here in Odessa and it's just so cute and um, she looks really sweet. It's very casual, very soft and she can wear it to church or she can wear it out, you know, to run errands with mommy, <laughs> but she just looks so sweet. She's tired. <laughs> we woke her, woke her up from her nap, but she looks precious and she will have so much fun on her very first Easter. And no shoes necessary. You nope. know, maybe when she'll have them on, maybe little, not. Yeah. Uh, they fall off anyway, so it's just, it's kind of a hazard to wear them. I love it. Oh, Harper, you are so stinking cute. Blake, thank you for walking her. Okay, you're pretty fond of this next baby. Yes. Baby Finley. This next baby <laughs> it happens to be my own, and he is wearing a carriage boutique outfit from Kensington's Closet as well, and Feltman oh. Brothers shoes from La B in Midland. His little outfit has a sheep embroidered there on the front, and um, we'll see if the shoes stay, but most likely not. <laughs> so for boys, I mean, Easter is a time to dress up, girl or boy, so have some fun. Right, right, and boys especially won't wear things like this for long, the little bubbles or the jumpers, yes. and so it's kind of one of those excuses to put them in one, and then they can wear their play clothes all the, the rest of the time. Paige, he is beautiful. Thank you. Okay, so our next little model is also one of our little boys. We're gonna welcome Jen Jensen down the row. Oh, he's so cute. So tell he us what so he's cute. wearing today. Jensen is wearing a smocked jumper, and it actually came from our consignment sale that we talked about, the one in Midland that Real we talked Lana, about. That's fantastic. Yes, Real Honest consignment sale, and he just looks precious. And then he's got on his water sole shoes. These are the same as Prince George wears. Well. So they're pretty special. And this is, you know, sandals will last all summer long. He can wear that anytime, anywhere. I love that. So our next model is Elijah. Elijah's wearing a seersucker outfit that Logan, our new um, assistant, found your new assistant. Yeah. Here at Studio 7 production assistant. She found on Zulily, which is a really cool app, and they have tons of things every day. I love it. Yes, and he looks so precious. He cute looks little like hat, he's straight out of the shoes. 30s or 40s, and yeah. I love it. So he'll look precious this Sunday at church and after for his Easter egg hunt. I love that so much. Our next sweet models are cousins. They are also part of our Studio 7 staff. Emery Karras, come on down. How beautiful they look they? beautiful. Emery is wearing a lace Laura Ashley dress from Dillard's, and she just looks beautiful. She looks quintessential Easter Sunday to me. Yes. And Karis is in second grade. She's getting a little bit older, so she's going for more of a cool um, tween look, and that's from Aeropostal PS, her dress and shoes. And I love the turquoise. She can wear that to school with a little sweater. Absolutely. I mean, and it works all spring, all summer, and the shoes are too cute. I mean, even with jeans or shorts, and they just they both just look gorgeous. And let's talk about their accessories because I love um, Emery's got the cute little headband and the gloves, and we know this isn't gonna last long, but it will for right. pictures. Right, right. <laughs> it will stay on as, at least for pictures, right, Emery? But that, the headband going across the head is such a cool look that it came from the music festivals we see people going to it and now it's infiltrated into everyday wear and then Karis's headband is just too cute and it's from Claire's in the mall and just tied in a bow and that just keeps their hair out of their face um, during church and after so fabulous they ladies look gorgeous. you look gorgeous thank you so much our next model is related to me this is my youngest daughter Olivia come on down Lou she's one of our favorites <laughs> she looks awesome her Easter dress is from Dillard's Tatum and Livy picked it out together and she's got on some really cool gold wedges as well and the hair I love her hair <laughs> we're gonna talk about this hair in an upcoming yes, uh, yes. Studio 7 this segment this hair is so awesome but I have to say she loved this dress she loved the color and she really loved the shoes great and that's that at that age that's what matters they want to put it on it's not a fight in the morning before church you won't be late and then they want to keep it on all day take family photos and I mean it looks cute and she can wear it to church for the rest of the spring and she looks really pretty thank you our next model falls into that tween category this is Blake Blake is wearing a beautiful gold peplum dress from Zoe limited her shoes are also gold flats from Sam Edelman which I love they're comfortable I mean she just looks so gorgeous so grown up 
I love this. I would wear this dress. Absolutely. I mean, I think it's awesome. This is a peplum. This is such a flattering style for all of us. It really is for all ages. It adds something girly to Blake's look, but for us, it accentuates the waist. It makes our waist look smaller and gives us that hourglass look. But I just think it looks so age appropriate on her. Yes. And so pretty, so feminine. And then with the embellishment at the neck, she doesn't need any jewelry. And another tween, a genuine tween. This is Faith. This is my oldest daughter. Come on out, sweet girl. We love Faith. And this dress is so cool. I love it. It's from Dillard's in the juniors department. So this is something that we all might be able to get in our size, but I really love it. It's comfortable, yet it's very flattering, and navy is my favorite color for Easter. I know, me too, I love it. And it's not maybe traditional, you kind of see the bright pinks and aquas, yeah. but for her, this was perfect. I think it's great for a tween and or an, a, a woman, an adult. But what I like about navy is a lot of times we're still cold on Easter, and so the navy looks appropriate for that, whereas sometimes your pastels kind of look awkward when it's so cold outside sure. in your dress for the spring. So I think navy is such a great spring transitional color. <laughs> Baby, you look beautiful. And our last handsome model is a true teenager. He looks fantastic. He does. This is da Davis, and he is wearing an outfit from several different places, but he looks so age appropriate. He's in junior high now, so the cool factor is definitely there. <laughs> his shirt is from Nordstrom.com, pants from Old Navy and Midland, and his shoes, which I love, they're awesome. Um, I think all of our husbands should have a pair. I do too. Uh, Kenneth Cole from Zappos, which is a really cool website where you can find just about anything. But he looks so handsome and he can mix and match each piece of this out outfit with other things in his closet. So it's just real easy. Davis, you are very handsome and I love your glasses too. <laughs> Thank you so much. So the moral of the story I think today for us is choose something comfortable that they will actually wear and have some fun for Easter. Yes, definitely have fun. It's one of the only times a year you get to do this. So dress them up, take them out, take pictures. I love it. Paige, thanks so much. Happy Easter.